Colombia is currently one of the most important markets for Australian education, specifically when uh, referring to ELICOS courses. Um, it is, the country is now the third most important uh, source for international students in the ELICOS uh, space after China and Brazil, which is a very impressive uh, result uh, considering the different sizes in population. Australia is also currently one of the most popular study destinations within the English-speaking countries, outperforming its competitors uh, significantly. And it has also shown uh, very solid growth in the past few years. Uh, almost doubling the numbers in terms of enrollments in the past five years. The reasons are varied. Bilingualism is still an issue in the country, although the government has implemented very ambitious national strategies that haven't really shown the expected results. The English language proficiency is still low in the country. Colombia is in the bottom of the list in Latin American countries in terms of English proficiency. So there are still many opportunities for Australian providers in Colombia. The government has also expressed in many occasions the big shortage in terms of English language uh, teachers that are looking for opportunities to be trained overseas because the local offer is not very strong. Colombia is also a market that's, uh, where students are uh, supported heavily by education agents. It is an agent-driven market, so Austria can help make those engagements uh, on the ground with uh, agents in the different cities of Colombia. Bogota has been the most important city for um, students going to Australia in the past, but Medellin, Barranquilla, Bucaramanga have also, have also gained uh, relevance in, in the past few years and Austria can help uh, making uh, those connections. So the current landscape for Australian providers in Colombia is very positive and there are very interesting opportunities to be pursued in Colombia.